Okay, we should be able to draw. Let's first compile, though, and ask the compiler what errors we've introduced. I'm sure there's several errors. Control-Shift-B, build started. And here's our error list. Cannot open include file C to lib. I forgot the D in there. C standard lib. Control shift B again. Well, I guess we could have just go on to the next error. Uh, updates not a member of my game. Why is update not a member of our game? Did we not declare it? Control Alt L. My game header file. There's an update right here. Update, let me new vertical tab group this one. Uh, is this the right way? No, it slots with an S, I believe. Let me do a control shift F here. Actually, it'll just be in my GL window. So let's look. My GL window, a header file, sorry. Uh, control F for slot. And it looks like the macro is actually lowercase slots with an S, so control V that right there. But now that I have updated that, we also have to remock the header file. If I go to the mock file and do a control F for update, we won't find anything about update in there because the, cause the macro is incorrect. So I'm going to control shift S to save. And then we have to remock our file. So C colon backslash mock.exe my game dot h and put the results to my game underscore mock dot cpp hit enter go over here say yes and do a search for update and there we go now update is part of the generated meta information metadata for signals and slots uh, for qt so control shift b add geometry function does not take for arguments, I thought it did. Go to definition. Let's look at that. Add geometry. Oh yes, it takes five. We added the render mode out here, but I'm actually, I think we should default that render mode to triangles, because most of the time we are rendering triangles. So in the header file here for the renderer, I'm going to say GL triangles. Control shift B. And we get linker errors. Render, initialize, GL, paint, GL. Why do we get the... Oh, that's right. Do you remember uh, when we have the two projects here? We have engine, well, engine tester as well, but engine has to expose functionality from the lib file and also from its associated DLL in order for sandbox game to link to it both at compile time, the lib files for compile time, the DLL is for runtime, and so the header files that these are going to be there but the linker cannot resolve them at compile time, hence we get these errors down here, linkers, I need to see them, well the, well the way we expose them with the, is with that declaration specification lowercase control shift or control u uh, dll export please export these for me and that basically says make everything on the interface public so i yeah, but we're inheriting from this i've had some issues when doing that let's let's see what the compiler says uh q widget q widget q widget that's right do you remember uh, when I right click here, go to properties on the engine, I was holding off on putting QT core D4 in this lib. I wasn't sure if I, or this list, I wasn't sure if I needed it or not. But that's what those those linker errors are here. Let me build this again. It's the, the, the build for the engine is trying to link to Q widget, focus, Q widget, win event, Q widget, all these things. And I can't find it because they're in the QT GUI. So let's add... Uh, right here, qt gui d4.lib. Hit enter, enter, control shift b, build again, build started, build succeeded. There we go. Okay, I'm going to right click on this and say close all. But this, I wish they kind of put a close all here, but if you want to do a close all, I believe it's in window. Close all documents right there, but I'm going to right click here, close all but this, 
Control F5. Here's hoping something shows up on the screen. Control F5. And it complains. No such slot. My update. This looks like I got a hunch this is a copy paste error. We copied from my GL window.cpp into my game.cpp. Uh, the connect for the slot. And we called it update in here, did we not? Here's our slot update instead of my update. So let's control F5, build and run. And see if we. Okay, that error's gone, but nothing's showing up on the screen besides our console window. Arrgh. Okay, what's the. Oh, I know. I know. We didn't. Uh, the render. The render is supposed to take over and be the window, is it not? Let me. Mm, right here. The renderer. The renderer. Uh, you know, I had a dream last night. Somebody was on TV was saying renderer. Uh, kind of awkward. And the initialize. Right here, to get anything to show, we have to say, show. Easy enough. Control Shift B. Build start, build succeeded. Run it. And nothing shows. That should have worked, actually. Oh. Oh, oh no. I have a hunch here. Build. Uh, I want to clean just the project. Let's... Let's clean and rebuild. When I clean, that deletes all the associated OBJ files. Look at that! Look at that! We have a spaceship! Look at that! <laughs> okay, now, it's not going to respond to any keyboard input because we haven't, we haven't added our input functionality here. Remember, we're going with this diagram here. We have my game and we have the renderer. Uh, we don't really have a ship yet. The input physics, those aren't there and neither is the lurper. But hey, we're drawing a triangle. That's kind of cool with our new system.